that yesterday we commemorated Battle of Britain Day, the 15th of September. It always marks a crucial date in the battle, that on which the Luftwaffe mounted its heaviest raids on London yet, for that summer of 1940, and on which the RAF responded in force. Figures show there were 56 Luftwaffe aircraft lost on that date to 28 from the Royal Air Force. It led, two days later, to Hitler postponing his invasion plans. Some 3,000 or so airmen are officially recognised for their involvement in the battle and they remain immortalised as the few. Of them, 574 pilots hailed from countries outside the UK, men from Poland, New Zealand, Canada, Czechoslovakia, Belgium, Australia, South Africa, France, Ireland, the United States, Southern Rhodesia, Barbados, Jamaica, Newfoundland and Northern Rhodesia, as well as the United Kingdom. All were recognised by Prime Minister Winston Churchill when he paid tribute in the House of Commons on the 20th of August, 1940. The gratitude of every home in our island, in our empire, and indeed throughout the world, except in the abode of the guilty, goes out to the British Airmen, who undaunted by odds, and wearied in their constant challenge and mortal danger, are turning the tide of the world war by their prowess and by their devotion. Never in the field of human conflict was so much owed by so many to so few.